And he said, Tabarakot Ta'ala in Surah Taha, verse number 131, Do not extend your eyes towards that which we have given of enjoyment to them, azwajan minhum zaharat al-hayat al-dunya, from the beauty of the life of this world, in order to tempt them and test them through that. Wafil hadith, likewise an authentic hadith, al-badhada tu min al-iman. Al-badhada tu min al-iman. Dressing down is from iman. Al-badhada, meaning that a person, and he doesn't always primp their self and make sure that their hair looks the nicest and that every hair, and he is exactly where, and he, it should be symmetrically. And they don't always coordinate between their socks and their thobe and their vest and everything else, right? And there are times where a person does that, like going to the salat, and times like the Eid, where a person does that more so. But al-badhada, generally, any out of humility that a person dresses down a little bit sometimes, is from iman, the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said. And so they use this and they look at this with one eye, open and one eye closed. And we understand the text and the light of each other. That of course what is meant is not going to extremes in one's personal appearance. There are many narrations that are indicative of that from the most amazing of them in its meaning. Is a statement of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam idha halaytum masahifakum wa zakhraftum masajidukum faddamaru alaykum is found with Al-Hafidh Al-Mundiri rahimullah ta'ala in a targheeb wa tarheeb authentically from the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam that the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said that when you adorn your masahif when you go to extremes in beautifying the mushaf the Quran you go to a person's house and they got a $3,000 Quran on their table if you were to open it, you would hear because it's never been open, right? When you have, when you halaytum, yani when you go to extremes and beautify your mushaf, is there anything more beautiful and important than the mushaf? But when you go to extremes and beautify your mushaf, وَزَخْرَفْتُمْ masajidakum. When you go to extremes and beautify your masajid, فَالدَّمَارُ alaykum. Then destruction is upon you. Then destruction is upon you. Is there anything more important than the masjid of all the places? Is there anything greater than the book of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? And so of course we understand that there are always in everything in life, there are the two extremes and the middle and the moderate course. And that is what is meant here. That a person should be moderate in beauty and the bulk of concern that they should give is to beautify their heart and to beautify their words and their statements and their actions and their intentions and their beliefs and their knowledge. This is beauty. This is beauty. This is the most important beauty. 